Unreal Engine has a built-in Python command support, similar to the one in programs like Maya or Blender. If you are experimenting or want to execute few lines of code, all you need to do is to open output log, switch command line mode to Python or Python REPL, and type some command. It may be sufficient at the very beginning, but sooner or later you will want to share your scripts and be able to run them quickly or even make tools from them or have some shared modules. In that case, before even running a script, you want it to be discoverable by the engine. It's best to keep your scripts in content slash Python subfolder of your project or the main Unreal installation or any plugin that you want to modify. You can also put it in documents slash Unreal Engine slash Python folder in your system. However, I prefer to keep everything in my projects or plugins so it's self-contained and easier to share and develop. There are also other ways for those who want to set more specific paths. Let's go through them one by one. First way is to go to Edit, Project Settings, and Find Python. Here's a section called Additional Paths. All we need to do is add a new element to the array and paste the path. It will be discovered by the engine after the restart. Second way is adding script to either UE Python path or Python path environment variable. You could do it either in system variables or if you run engine with custom command line, you can construct the env variable yourself in the shell session and then run it. The last way is adding script path directly to syspath. We could do that in output log import sys and then run command syspath.append and put the path to the script in brackets. That should work if you are just testing the script. However, if it should run on each engine startup, you can either add some setup script to startup scripts in plugins. To do that, we go to project settings again. Let's find Python. And here is startup script. So just create similar script to the comment we typed in the output log and put it right here. Or you could create a script called init unreal py. We have to create that file in the folder that is already discoverable by the engine and whatever is inside the script will be launched automatically on startup. As we already know how to make our scripts discoverable, let's try running some hello world and put it in content slash Python folder of our project. As you can see, there is no such folder or maybe it's hidden. I recommend changing content browser settings if you are to work on automation. Click on the settings gear on the right side and enable show empty folders, enabled here then show developers content and show plugins content. I would also enable show engine content. We can also try making sure that this folder doesn't exist by right clicking on content folder and showing it in Explorer. As you can see, it's empty. So I will create such folder in the content browser. Right click new folder and call it Python. I will navigate to that folder in Windows File Explorer and I will cre create a hello.py file. As you can see, this file exists in fact. However, it is not visible in Unreal Engine. Python files are not considered as assets and they remain hidden. Be aware of that and don't freak out. My IDE of choice is PyCharm, so I will add this folder to my project structure. If you work on VS Code, you can simply open VS in this folder. I will go to File, Settings, then navigate to Project PyCharm, Project Structure, and add new content root. This content root will lead to my project slash content slash Python folder, I will apply 
and now I can edit my hello file. Our hello world will be super simple. We will have some say hi function that says hi. And maybe let's print something simple on each import. Please note that I am using Unreal Logging in the first place, but in the second, I'm using the default Python print just to show that there are two ways of printing and each of them works a bit differently. The file was saved, so let's go to the engine and restart it. So the script is discovered on engine startup. My project has just restarted. Let's go to output log, make sure that we are using Python command line and see if we can import the function that we just created. It works. It uh, printed the message that always prints when we are importing things. And now we can say hi. Everything is correct. That's all about making scripts discoverable by Unreal. And in the next video, I will show you different ways of running your scripts or tools.